Celine, what are you doing up? I couldn't sleep. Do you mind if I join you? Amber told me about Zoo. I know he was evil and everything, but... He was my brother, Celine. Your brother? My kid brother, Martin. But how? Why did he... Become Zoot? Martin was the baby of the family. My parents loved him to pieces. Took him everywhere. They were always laughing, playing together. The three of them were inseparable. And then, when the virus struck, and they died. He changed? He was so angry, so bitter. You wouldn't believe this, but Martin was actually a very gentle boy. I had to protect him when he first started school. Some kids used to bully him. I didn't protect him last night, did I? Oh, Bray, it wasn't your fault. I brought him here. He'd still be alive if I hadn't. But you wanted to get him and Trudy together again. And for him to look after his baby. It wasn't your fault, Bray. You were trying to help. Maybe people should just leave things as they are and not get involved. No. Bray, I didn't know. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. You're cold. I'll go make us a hot drink, okay? Thanks. going on, Bray? Rats! All over the cafe! Is that all? I thought somebody was being murdered or something. Rats aren't a joke, Lex. They spread disease. And bite you if they're cornered. I'll bring in the locos to kill you in your beds. No, Bray. Zoot was his brother. His brother? Oh. That all makes sense now. What difference does it make? He's still a traitor. We should kick him and his tart out. You killed her baby's father. She's not going anywhere. You shut that brat up. All right, everybody, I think we've all had enough. But as soon as we get up, we clean this pigsty up. She needs feeding. Do you mind saying? Of course not. Here. Come on, little no name. Let's get you sorted. Cheeky cow. Trudy. Little no name. What did she mean by that? It's the truth. You haven't named her yet. What business is it of hers? 
Look, I know you're upset, but don't take it out, Celine. What were you doing out there with her anyway? I wasn't with her. I was on my own. Thinking about Martin. He wasn't Martin anymore. He was Zoot. I thought you loved him. I did. Once. Well, if you changed your mind, why'd you let me bring him in here? I wanted to see what I felt. And? Don't you know, Bray? Can't you see? I love you. Oh, Trudy. No, it's true, Bray. I want us to be together, to bring up the baby. That's why I haven't given her a name. I want us to choose. Together. Trudy, so much has happened to us all. We're all hurting. Confused. I mean, I don't know how I feel. All I know is Martin is dead. I... I need time. Give me time. Trudy, please. Can't sleep, huh? Ugh, those rats. I'm sure one of them's gotten to my place. You can come and lie down with me, babe. I'll protect you. I can do without your kind of protection. Thanks. Fine. I hope it's nice and comfy out here for you. Waking up with rat. She'll survive, but we won't if we don't get our act together. There's no point in surviving the virus only to die of food poisoning, so I've drawn up this. Well, what is it? It's a work order. I've divided all the chores amongst us, so we all do everything. Sweeping floors. Only in the mall. Everyone's responsible for their own living spaces. Cleaning windows? Where's Bray? He's down there with Dell. Food foraging. We need to get some fresh fruit and vegetables. We can't live on this process muck forever. But where is he? He isn't here, is he? Typical. It's all right, Dal. I'll come with you. Any questions? When do we start? Now, while we can still see through the dirt. Come on. What are you two doing? Why aren't you working? We are. We're exercising Bob. Uh, call that working? Yes. And after, Ember said we can go play. Play? What at? I don't know. Do you know any good games? Have you ever played poker? You mean cards. Like Snap. Sort of. Shall we? You've got a cushy job, haven't you? The baby's a bit bored. Poor thing. It was whinging. They like movement. Pretty thing. Hello. I'm Sandra. Yes. You're Annie Sandra. That's my name. 
Has it got one yet? No. What's she thinking of? We can't keep calling it it. To be honest, I don't think she's interested. Some people don't deserve babies. Well, I don't suppose she planned it, did she? Not with that suit, anyway. I think she'd rather it was Brace. Do you think he'll stick around? Who knows? She seems to be doing all right so far, lying around all day playing the tragedy queen. I bet that's postnatal depression. I bet all about that. I'll go and see her. Cheer her up. <laughs> Where are you going, Chloe? Um, I'm, I'm doing some cleaning. Funny people. I wonder where your Uncle Bray's got to. Look at this place. It's a disgrace. I'll have to write to the council about it. We're not going to find any food along here. Plenty of time. Did you bring it? Yeah. Oh, let's see it then. Go over there. You catch her. Lex, we're meant to be looking for food. Dal, look around you. What do you see? What do you mean? Any demon dogs? Any locos? No. Then let's have some fun. Come on. Catch. Struck one. Love me again. You've picked this up quick, haven't you? Another game? I'll tell you what, shall we make it more interesting? How? Let's play for something real. Okay. Now, what could we play for? Go on, you can do it. I know. I'm going to. I'm just thinking about it, that's all. Chicken, do I have to come over and show you how you baby? Wait. Uh, it's too dangerous. You're pathetic. You're just like a little girl. I ain't scared. I am demon dogs. Hey, strays on our turf, dogs. Get out. Go, go. Get out. Get out. Get out. Not that way. We don't want to leave him back in the mall. Split up! Sam, you take this lot. We'll look after the other one. Come on! So that sweeping today, washing up tomorrow, cleaning the doors and windows the next day, and sweeping again the day after. Do you want another hand? Well, back to work then, I guess. Thanks. <sighs> it's all right. I'll finish walking the dog for you. Come on, Bob. Go on. <laughs> That's nice, isn't it? We ought to get you some real milk, though. Make you into a big, strong girl. Where is everyone? Oh, well, Ryan, for a start. He is his broom, but no Ryan. And where's Chloe? Cleaning somewhere, apparently. And what about Zandra? She's gone to cheer up Trudy. She's supposed to be washing up. Come on, sunshine. Shall we try and find your Uncle Bray? He's nice, isn't he? Shall I let you in on a little secret? I think your Uncle Bray is very, very nice.
did your mummy used to wash you? I bet she did. Well, I'm your mummy now, aren't I? Jack? What now? We're hungry. No, not now, I'm busy. But we're really hungry. Okay. Uh, do my chores. Uh, clean the windows for me and uh, I might think about giving you some food. We're already doing Ryan's. Why? What's he giving you? Nothing. We lost at cards. Well, seriously, right, you stupid idiots. Paul says if you don't give us some, he'll tell everybody. Oh, I'm fed up with this. <laughs> Go on then. Tell everybody. Then all the food will have to be shared. And you won't get any more treats. So what's it gonna be? Clean the windows? Or no more treats? Here we are. She's been a little angel. I thought you'd run off with her. Would you care if I did? If you didn't want a baby, why did you... With Zoot, of all people. You don't know anything about him. I know he was a vicious thug. He wasn't always. How long did you know him? None of your business. You must have known Braven, if Zoot was his brother. So? I was just wondering. Well, you can keep wondering, and you can keep your hands off him as well. Where have you been, Bray? I've been worried. I've been trying to see what the locals are up to. Now they've no leader. Did you see them? Yeah, down at the warehouses. They... I um... wished you wouldn't go out, Bray. I panic every time you do. Thanks, Celine. We'll look after the baby now. We're going to choose a name for her. That's nice. What's been going on? Oh, she's just stirring as usual. What about? I don't want to talk about it. What should we call her? Trudy. My brother died yesterday, the father of your child. Don't you care? Haven't you any feelings at all? I do. I told you I love you. I always have. You mean, even when you're with Martin? Of course. So you went with my brother out of what? Spite? Jealousy? I don't know. I thought I liked him. He was nice at first. I'm sorry he's dead. Really, I am. Bray. I'll be very good to you. We'll be good together, all three of us. We can look after Martin's baby together. That's what we'll call her, shall we? Martina. After him. about Zootina. What are you two doing? Those aren't your jobs. We're doing them for Ryan and Jack. Why? Patsy? Dad, what's wrong? Is Lick's back? No, I don't, I don't know. I thought he was with you. We got jumped by some demon dogs. We separated and tried to escape. Has Lex been caught? I don't know. I was too busy getting away. I'm sure Lex can look after himself. But did you manage to get some food? Only this. New type of vegetable? Could do with a cup of coffee. Get real. If anyone goes outside, Amber the Hun will just grab them for something. Come here and I'll grab you instead. Get off. I'm gonna tidy myself up. Look like a mess. Hold that. Hold it. Sorry, babe. You know what I need? One of those big round vanity mirrors. I used to have one at home. It was pink. I'll get you one next time I go out. The dogs might get you next time. Never. 
I'm too quick for them. I was just toying around with them so Dal could get away. Oh, you did get back. Don't sound so pleased. I suppose you didn't get any food either. Dal back then. Complete with sweaty baseball mitt. <laughs> You're supposed to be washing up, Sandra. I'm having a rest. From what? You haven't even started. That chick needs to chill out. She's just a bossy cow. It's just frustration. That's what it is. She needs a fella to show her a good time. And I suppose you're just the guy for the job. Have you no taste at all? <laughs> She's here in black and white. Cooking, Amber and Celine. Dinner, 5.30. So where are they? Here. Where's Celine? I've given her the night off. Where's the grub then? Sorry? You're supposed to be making us a meal. It says so on there. Oh, really? It also says Ryan sweeping, Zandra washing up, Jack cleaning windows. Shall I go on? You mean? If you don't do your chores, why should I do mine? No chores, no food. Who says? You're not the leader. Well, someone's got to take charge of this chaos. We don't need bossing about. We had all that with the adults. We can do as we like now. Is that what you think? Yeah. And who are you to tell us what to do? Fine. Do as you like. Eat yourselves stupid. Live like pigs. I've had enough. Right. Spam and beans. Zandra? I just wanted to say, I'm sorry, for getting you to bring him here. Yeah, well, it's done now. Where are you going? I'm tired, Trudy. I'm going to bed. Oh. Bray, what if the locals ever find out what happened to him? I wouldn't give much for our chances. Trudy. They've chosen Ebony as the new leader. What? I just pray she never finds out about the baby. For more information on audio dramatizations, please visit www.tribeworld.com. Keep the dream alive.